here's the other problem. No way. Hopefully, hopefully we can get this figured out. I don't know how we get out of here either. They're not opening. What's up guys? I have been back in the US for a little bit now. Today is a travel day. We are headed to Denver for like less than 12 hours, grabbing dinner with a player there. And then I'm going to see Sarah who, she's awesome. She has her own like concierge company for athletes. So she helps baseball players, soccer players, football players. She's great. So I'm gonna meet with her and then head to Arizona to see, see the guys over there. California. So on the road for a few days, but it should be fun. Just got to the airport. I think I'm running off of like three hours of sleep. Had to watch October start, which was at like 2 a.m. started. And then had to get up early for calls and to get ready to go to the airport, work out, all that. So I'm exhausted. I gotta go straight to dinner with the player when I get to Denver. So it's gonna be a long, long day. Drop my bags off and then head downtown near the ballpark to get dinner. All right, super quick outfit change. Got this on. It's actually very warm here, so probably gonna be hot. Got to call an Uber and head downtown to grab dinner and then hopefully get some sleep tonight. dinner had a great great conversation great time it was good to catch up with this player and uh, I'm gonna get some sleep and then wake up early get a workout in catch up with Sarah and then off to the airport <laughs> good morning got some got some sleep and uh, got a good workout in spent a little time with Sarah this morning now about to catch an uber head to the airport and fly uh, to Arizona luckily I get to fly out of JSX this time which is like a semi-private airline and I get to fly out of like the private airport here so I get to avoid Denver Airport first things first when I get to Arizona I need to go drop Trevor's truck off at um, a shop because apparently it has some sort of leak so I gotta go take care of that for him and then I gotta drive his McLaren a little oh, which yeah I know boohoo for me so that way it doesn't die because it's not really being driven at all go into the facility and see the guys and do some more work yeah. so just had a call with one of my other clients go over some stuff for him so it's a lot of like what my job is especially during the season it's just like little things come up my players and I have to deal with them that's what I've been doing waiting for my flight uh, I've got some breakfast and I think it's super foggy out so my flight's a little delayed Okay, let's go drop this truck off and see what in the hell Here's the other problem. Like I've driven this truck before and this light is just perpetually on. So like you never know when like something's actually wrong with this car. Hopefully, hopefully we can get this figured out. One of the other things that I need to do when I'm here is I need to go see Sophia. For those of you who don't know Sophia, if you follow Eric Sim, <laughs> It's his little daughter, and she is my absolute favorite, just the cutest thing ever. She's a future Lewis Sports client, so, you know, recruiting him young. <laughs> but I love her, I'm Auntie Rachel. All right, we've got Anthony here, who's also the great editor of this vlog. Whoa, whoa. Uh, he was nice enough to give me a ride. Now, back to get uh, the McLaren. Let's check out this trickle charge, it's pretty cool. I gotta figure out how to open this. Cut that last part of me trying to figure out how to open this. Thanks. No. No, I don't think I will. When he's gone for a long period of time and he can't turn his car on so the battery doesn't die, it trickle charges it. So when he comes back, it'll work. All right, I forgot. I need a, need a booster seat. 
Let's go grab a pillow. Okay, so much better. Now I can see over the steering wheel. Hey guys, this vlog today is brought to you by Skillshare. So I just wanted to take a moment and talk to you about this amazing platform. You may know Skillshare for classes in photography, film, video editing, and illustration. But did you know Skillshare has hundreds of career focused classes too? I've been using Skillshare to help grow my business, attract new clients, and differentiate my business through my media presence. Some of my favorite classes are Aaron Winters, Vlogging for Business, and Lily Singh's video storytelling on YouTube and beyond. With Trevor playing in Japan this year, I wanna be able to expand my audience overseas and show what it's like to be a player agent both in America and overseas. Skillshare has been able to show me how to utilize video content to enhance my business. If you also wanna grow your creative style or attract more clients, Skillshare can absolutely help you maximize your potential. But luckily for you guys and my viewers, Skillshare is offering the first 1,000 people to use this link that's gonna be on screen and in the description, a one month free trial of Skillshare. I'm a huge believer in the idea of you never stop learning. Be sure to take advantage of thousands of available classes on Skillshare and try for free today. Okay, I was just going through my mail when I got here and I got from Greeny Cards this nice little letter. He sent me this very cool Trevor Bauer um, Diamondbacks card. OG, I love it. And uh, he asked if I could trade him one of my signed cards. Uh, Greeny Cards, sports cards. So he like collects and sells and trades and does some cool stuff with cards. So you guys should check him out. I will have to get a signed uh, card of mine to you. They were a limited time, limited edition, but I might have an extra, so I can trade you. Okay, and I just got to my desk, and among like many things that were sitting here um, on my desk for me to open, the best little present. I love it. Two hours later. All right, so tonight it's gonna be a late night in the Momentum facility. Um, we've got a bunch of golf YouTubers out here that are here to make some content. They challenged Eric to baseball, so should be fun to watch. They've got a huge following on YouTube in the golf world. Should be fun. Hi, dear guys. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Okay guys, so the Red Sox are in town in Arizona playing the D-backs and I will be going to the game tonight watching a player there. So I'm gonna go with the newest member of Luba Sports, Sean. He's gonna be coming along with me and we're gonna go watch the game. I'm actually very much looking forward to going to this game with Sean because Unlike most games where I am literally there by myself, that's usually how I go to games. That's how I watch games. I'm rarely ever there with like friends or family, um, never like drinking any of that fun stuff um, like most fans do. At least this time um, I will be with someone else, get to watch the game, with someone else who appreciates baseball as well and like the business side of baseball. So that should be, should be fun and a little change of pace from what I normally do. All right, so we just got to the game. We just parked. This is Sean. Sean, introduce yourself. Say hello. I'm Sean. I'm Rachel's intern. Boring. We got tickets sent to us, and this is the first time that you don't have to go to will call. You usually go to like the player will call to pick them up. I don't know how we get out of here either. But this time they were sent to my mobile app, which is sweet. They're not opening. So we gotta figure out how to how to deal with that. We've got five minutes to get them to open. And Sean, you have never been to Chase, correct? Correct. Right. So this is gonna be your first time? First time. First time, all right. You'll have to let let everyone on the blog know what you think. What are the, you said you've been to three three ballparks, been right? to Minute Maid, my home field. Okay. Been to Truist and- I love that one. I've been to the old Ranger Stadium when I was an infant. Well, the new one is sick. The new one, I wish I could. Yeah. Seen. Okay, so the tickets worked, and Sean is wondering who he roots for, but you're gonna learn the ways of working at an agency, which is you don't root for teams anymore, you root for players, okay? Yep. So, I have a favorite player tonight. He has a favorite player tonight, which is good. No way. How did you get that? It literally hit <laughs> off like four other people. 
Got it right here. First ever foul ball MLB game. All right, we came to watch who we were here to watch. Got it, got it done. Got it done. Leaving a little early, but uh, what did you think? Uh, atmosphere was great. Red Sox fans came to play. Red Sox came to play. Um, and it was good environment. Chase Stadium, nice field. Yeah.